Princess Anne speaks out after horse-related concussion. Following a concussion from a horse-related incident at her country house on June 23rd, Princess Anne has publicly spoken for the first time since her hospital stay. During a memorial service commemorating the centenary of the Newfoundland National War Memorial on July 1st, the 73-year-old royal's message was delivered by the Canadian Governor-General. Princess Anne said she regretted missing the occasion because of her rehabilitation. In her statement, she said, I am unable to be with you today as you commemorate the brave efforts and sacrifices of the Newfoundland Regiment who went into battle on the first day of the Somme. She expressed greetings to everyone gathered and remembered her involvement in the 2016 Memorial of the Battle of Beaumont Hamill. Following the incident at Gatcombe Park, where Princess and suffered injuries, likely resulting from a horse's head or legs, Buckingham Palace revealed on June 24 that she had been hospitalized. It is yet unknown exactly what happened in the accident, though reports suggest it caused momentary memory loss. Released from Southmead Hospital on June 28, Princess and is currently recovering at her Gloucestershire home under continuous rehabilitation support. Only with permission from her medical team will Princess and resume her public responsibilities. No specific date is given. Vice Admiral Sir Timothy Lawrence thanked the team at Southmead Hospital for their treatment during her brief hospital stay. Often involved in several events yearly, Princess and is among the royal family members most known for their tenacity and commitment. Her dedication to service is unwavering, even with her current medical issues.